Hello students, welcome to this series of mathematics lessons. In this presentation, we will study about addition. Addition. After studying this unit, you can able to add a given 5 digit number without carrying, with carrying and you could able to solve verbal problems based on addition. We can add two numbers in any order. We can start with the units place, we can start with the tens place, we can start with any other place. The process remains similar. We just need to modify the method to ourselves. Addition of 5 digit numbers without carrying. Let us see example 1. We need to add 45,237 and 31,210. We can represent 45,237 as 45,237, 7 is in units place, 3 is in tens place, 2 is in hundreds place, 5 is in thousands place and 4 is in 10,000 place. We already saw this in the previous chapter. First let us represent 45,237. In the units place, we have 7 mangoes, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. In the tens place, we have got 30 mangoes, where each basket contains 10 mangoes. 10 mangoes in this basket, 10 mangoes in this basket, and 10 mangoes in this basket. Totally, we have 10 plus 10 plus 10, 30 mangoes. Now, let us move on to hundreds place. In hundreds place, we have 200 mangoes. In this basket, we have got 100 mangoes. In this basket, we have got 100 mangoes. 100 plus 100 mangoes is equal to 200 mangoes. Now, let us move on to thousands place. In thousands place, we have got 5000 mangoes. Here we can see in the thousands place, we have 1000, 2000, 3000, 4000, 5000, 5000 mangoes. Similarly, in the 10,000s place, we have 40,000 mangoes. In this basket, we have got 10,000 mangoes. In this basket, 10,000. In this basket, 10,000. In this basket, 10,000. So, totally 4 baskets we can see here. Each basket contains 10,000 mangoes. So, totally 40,000 mangoes. We are done with representation of 45,237. Now let us see 31,210. We follow the same representation for this number as well. In the unit space, we have got 0 mangoes. We have got 0 mangoes. In the tens place, we have got 10 mangoes. In the hundreds place, we have got 200 mangoes. In the thousands place, we have got 1000 mangoes. You can see there is only one basket. In the 10,000 place, we have got three baskets of mangoes that is 30,000 mangoes. Now let us add these two numbers. In the units place we have got 7 mangoes plus 0 mangoes in the second number. In first number we have got 7 mangoes. In the second number we have got 0 mangoes. So 7 plus 0 is equal to 7. Now let us see tens place. In first number we have got 30 mangoes. In the second number we have got 10 mangoes so totally 40 so in the tens place we have got 4 mangoes 4 baskets of mangoes in tens place we have got 4 we can represent this as 40 now let us move on to hundreds place in hundreds place of first number we have got 200 mangoes in the second number we have got 200 mangoes so 200 plus 200 is equal to 400. Now let us move on to thousands place. In first number we have got 5000 mangoes. In the second number we have got 1000 mangoes. So 5000 plus 1000 is equal to 6000. Finally in the ten thousands place in first number we have got 40,000 mangoes. In the second number we have got 30,000 mangoes. 
40,000 plus 30,000 is equal to 70,000. When we add all these numbers, we will get 76,447. We are done with addition of 5 digit numbers without carrying. Now let us see with carrying addition of 5 digit number with carrying. Look at the example 1. We need to find the sum of 38,765 and 25,978. We can represent 38,765 as in the units place we have got 5 beads. In the tens place we have got 60 beads. Similarly, we follow the same principle for second number. Now let us add these two numbers. Shall we? This part represent our first number. This part represent our second number. We need to add these two numbers. We have placed the numbers in the proper position. Unit place of first number matches with the unit place of second number. Tens place of first number matches with tens place of second number and so on. Enough of the discussion. Let us add these two numbers. In the units place of first number, we have got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5 beats. In the unit space of the second number, we have got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 plus 5 is equal to 13. Is equal to 13. We cannot represent 13 in units place, right? So what we will do is, we will rewrite this as 10 plus 3. 10 plus 3 is equal to 13. Both are equal, right? So we will carry 10 to the tens place. What we are remaining with? 3. We will write 3 in the units place. Now in the tens place we have got extra bag of beads. Let us move on to tens place. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 60 beads. Or we can say 6 bag of 10 beads. In the second number of tens place we have got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. 70 bits. 60 plus 70 is equal to 130. Remember, we also got a carry. So, 60 plus 70 plus 10 is equal to 140. We cannot represent 140 in tens place, right? So we will write it as 100 plus 40. In the tens place we can write 4. 4 is in tens place which is nothing but 40, right? We will write 4 in the tens place and we will carry 100 to the hundreds place. Now let us see hundreds place. Hundreds place of first number we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 700 in the first number. And in the second number, we have got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 900 beats in the hundreds place of second number. Now let us add these two. Remember, we also have a carry. 700 plus 900 plus 100 is equal to 1700. 1700. We cannot represent 1700 in hundreds place, right? So what we will do is, we will split it 1000 plus 700. We will carry 1000 to the thousands place and we will write the remaining 700 in the hundreds place. So we will write it as 7. Now let us move on to thousands place. In thousands place of first number, we have got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8,000 beats. Thousands place of second number, we have got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5,000 beats. Remember, we also have a carry of 1,000 from the previous place. That is, from hundreds place, we have a carry of 1,000. When we add, when we add all these, we will get 
8000 plus 5000 is equal to 13,000 13,000 plus 1000 is equal to 14,000 we cannot represent 14,000 in the thousands place right so what we will do is we will split the number 10,000 plus 4,000 10,000 plus 4,000 is equal to 14,000 right we will put 10,000 carry to the 10,000 place we are remaining with 4,000 4,000 is written as 4 since it is in the thousands place finally in the 10,000 place we have got 30,000 beads in the second number we have got 20,000 beads remember we also have a carry of 10,000 20,000 plus 30,000 plus 10,000 is equal to 60,000 so we will represent 60,000 in the 10,000 place as 6 so the sum of two numbers is 64,743 we added two numbers by carrying the numbers from the previous position now let us solve a verbal problem which says an Indian cricketer scored 14,025 runs in test cricket and 15,759 runs in one day matches. How many runs did the cricketer score in all? We need to find the total number of runs scored by this cricketer. In test matches he scored 14,025 runs. In the one day matches he scored 15,759 runs. We need to find the total runs scored by the cricketer in both test cricket and one day crickets. So we will add these two numbers. We get 29,784. Notice one thing. We used carry to add these two numbers. 9 plus 5 is equal to 14. So what we will do is we can represent 14 as 10 plus 4. We will add 10 to the tens place. So tens place have a carry of 10 and we are remaining with 4. We will put that in the units place. We are done with the units part. In the tens place we have got 20 plus 50, 70. And previously we had carry of 10, so 80. So we will write 8 in the tens place. We are done with the tens place. Let us move on to hundreds place. In hundreds place we have got 0 plus 700 which is equal to 700. So we will write 7 in the hundreds place. We are done with the hundreds place. In the thousands place we have got 4000 plus 5000 which is equal to 9000. We represent 9000 as 9 in the thousands place. Finally in the ten thousands place we will add 10,000 plus 10,000 which is equal to 20,000. So 20,000, the total runs scored by a cricketer is 29,784 runs. The content of this video is borrowed from Karnataka Textbook Society, Bangalore, under fair usage policy. This video is presented by Avari Technologies. Please do hit subscribe button to get more content. Thank you.